What's up guys, the Hackspot here, and as guys know, Snapchat++ Plus Plus and similar tweaks have basically been dead. But I found a sneaky little trick that still lets you screenshot, screen record, or just watch the Snapchat without the other person knowing. If that sounds interesting, let's dive right in. All right, now before we start, creepy video. So we got a creepy sponsor called Spy My Phone. Spy My Phone is a powerful spy app that is used to conveniently spy your kids or family's cell phones, including Android phones, tablets, iPhones, and iPads. There's things like call logs, location tracking and geofencing, seeing text messages, clues, and keyword alerts. Oh yeah, this thing has it all. Links down below. All right, so I am going to be using two iPhone 10s, as you can see over here. The one on the left is on iOS 13, so the latest version of iOS. This is a beta version, so it works on basically everything. The one on the right is on iOS 12, so it works regardless on whatever firmware you're on and also what device you're on. So this is super crazy. Let's get started. All right, so first thing that we have to do is enable assistive touch. So I'm gonna demonstrate this on iOS 13 first. What you wanna do is open up the settings application and over here, head down until you find accessibility. And over here, scroll all the way down. There's accessibility shortcut, tap on that option and enable assistive touch. Now, once you do that, triple tap on your home button or lock button and you'll get this right here. Now on iOS 12, it's a little bit different, but still the same. What you want to do again is open up the settings application. Once there, go to general, and over here is going to scroll down until you find accessibility, tap on it. Then again, go to scroll down and look for assistive touch. There it is again, and enable it. And there you go, you get that same dot right there. All right, and we are basically done. Let's get started. So I'm gonna open up Snapchat on this device, send myself a snap, let's do it up this little guy right here boom there he is let's go ahead and send it over to myself on oh, my buttons in the way let's go ahead and send it and there i am let's go ahead and send it and i got the message right there now we're going to keep an eye on this delivered over here so i'm going to go and put this device right there and now let's go ahead and use this device so i'm going to go and open up the snapchat let's go over here Swipe over to the left, there is a Snapchat. Now, what you guys wanna do is swipe down or swipe up to bring a control center, whatever your device is, and then put your device into airplane mode. Make sure Wi-Fi is off, cellular is off, and also Bluetooth is off, and then go back over here. All right, so now that our device is in airplane mode, I'm gonna tap on the Snapchat, take a look at it, and then I can also go ahead and screenshot it, screen record it, do whatever I want, save it. And now what we wanna do is enter the power down menu. So on the iPhone, it's volume up, down, and then hold down on the power button. But on other devices, it's just hold down on the power button. But again, on the iPhone 10, it's volume up, down, then hold down on the power button. So once you guys are here, you guys can see I screenshotted it. I just take a look at it. I could tap on the assistive touch icon. And now what I wanna do is tap and hold on the home button. So there it is. And type in my passcode if I do have one. And just like that, it kind of restarts my entire device, clears up the RAM, and we are good to go. So now the moment of truth, I'm gonna swipe down, take on off, off of airplane mode and we are good to go. Go back to Snapchat and let's see if it says screenshot or opened. And you can see it doesn't even say I opened it. So that is super cool. Let's go check on this device over here. And boom, and there it is. It still says delivered. It doesn't say I screenshotted it or even opened it. So it does work. And would you look at that? It's crazy. Now I'm actually gonna open up the Snapchat and now it is actually opened. So isn't that crazy? Guys, make sure to follow the steps exactly as shown in the video. Otherwise it might get awkward. And also test it out yourself just to make sure the hack is still working. This is the Hackspot. Thank you for watching. Peace. Lately I went missing with no permission, it's part of it I've been working harder than competition from start of it Now they looking at me, I see them all through the rear view Kill yourself to get your spot, then they die to be near you They think that I made it, cause I made it past them They were never the target, my target is past